Beastie Boy fans seem to be anything but beasts, while Run DMC fans, lookalikes included, seemed more concerned with upholding a banned image many don't know about. Run DMC, no violence. They don't promote violence. They just rock it hard, New York way. And that's the way the whole night went. Two bands that have onlookers more occupied with a bad boy image that wasn't to be found at least before the concert. I don't drink vodka. I keep a microphone inside my locker. Go to school every day. On the wall, I play. I'm a chilly man, and this is the day. Run DMC, yeah! But the song and dance routine came second. Security was first. The lines were moving nice and slow because everyone was frisked before the show. Ain't no thing. I ain't got nothing on me. It's all right. What I think about it? Does it make you mad? Not really. I'm going to get into the concert. No, they don't want no trouble here. So this is cool with me. No problem. Now, even though promoters of this concert tour say it's the bands that are getting the bad rap, no one is taking any chances. Everyone who will watch tonight's performance will not only have to be frisked, but they'll have to walk through a metal detector as well. And if that wasn't enough, many concert goers were given the once over by portable metal detectors. It all goes back to a Long Beach concert last August when there was an eruption of gang violence. But things went very smooth tonight. They're going very well. The crowd is, uh, is, is very well behaved, uh, very quiet. Things certainly were not quiet inside. The concert started, the bands apparently proving the violence has been blown out of proportion by the media. And perhaps to get back at the media, our cameras were allowed to roll on the Beastie Boys for a grand total of 26 seconds. Oh!